Hey guys, ETN Sound of Sombros here. Today we're going to be knocking out another gameplay video, and we're going to be featuring Kagura, the Unyuji Master. And remember guys, if you guys enjoy the video, please give us a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, and stay tuned because we're going to keep putting out a ton of content from Mobile Legends. Alright guys, I'm going to go ahead and dive right into the gear set. If you have not watched our Kagura Spotlight video, please do that first. I explain how the abilities work and how they work in conjunction to one another. This is more of an advanced look. We're going to talk about gear sets, abilities, emblems, and then how we're going to show you how those movesets work out in-game. Alright guys, as we start digging into the gear sets, keep in mind two really important themes. Number one, cooldown reduction. Without her moves, Kagura is nothing, so getting those moves back as soon as possible is extremely important on her. Number two, magic power. Kagura's main and only role is to deal as much damage as humanly possible. The more magic power, the more damage you deal. Simple as that. So without further ado, our first item is going to be Enchanted Talisman. Obviously, we get the magic power and the cooldown reduction that we just talked about being so important. But what makes this a great first item is the HP and mana regen. Kagura is able to stay in lane for a very long time if you know how to play her. She throws her umbrella around over and over again using a lot of mana but doing a lot of damage and it makes it really hard for enemy heroes to get near her. So the extra health and the extra mana regen really help her stay in lane for a lot longer than you would normally be able to. And item number two is Magic Shoes. The cooldown reduction is the obvious reason we take magic shoes, but the reason we take boots this early is because movement speed is extremely key to her kit. Believe it or not, Kogura constantly has to reposition to throw her umbrella around, and she constantly has to reposition to pull off her moves and her combination of moves, making movement speed extremely essential to her kit. And our third item is Fleeting Time. We get a bunch of magic power, and 20% more cooldown reduction. So at this point in the game, we've cut the cooldown of all of our abilities in half, which is absolutely awesome. And let's not forget that Fleeting Time has an amazing passive. Immediately after killing an enemy hero, you reduce the cooldown of all your abilities by 30%. This passive is huge on Kagura because it allows her to sustain a continual high amount of damage in team fights. And this passive is huge in helping you get to the point where you're dealing 30 to 40% of your team's damage every game. And the sooner you can build this next item, guys, the better. Because Guardian Relic gives you a huge boost in damage. Because not only does it give you 90 magic power, but it increases all the magic power you have by 25%. And the next item we're taking on is Astral Wand. We get some awesome magic power and awesome magic penetration, which increases our damage to everyone, but especially tanks. And last but not least is Blood Wings. Not only do you get an insane 150 magic power, but the unique passive covenant adds two health points for every one point of magic power added. And at this point, you're talking over a thousand health. And let's be honest, if you're getting to the point where you're buying a six item, it's been a pretty long game so far. So the extra HP to help you stay in fights and deal even more damage longer is pretty awesome. Alright guys, that is my gear set I use. I have fiddled around with a bunch of different items and I find these to be hands down, game in and game out my most effective. Next, let's talk about abilities. I almost always take interference on Kagura because her ability set allows us a lot of opportunities to dive under tower. And let's be real, I hate dying under tower. If I'm going to flex my muscles, show that I can go under tower and kill somebody, I want to come out alive and feel like an absolute boss. But when I do take a different ability, it's always Purify, because one of the great things about her kit is her ability to get out of danger. With her second ability, she's either able to teleport to her umbrella or dash out. But when you're CC'd, the ability to hit Purify, get out of that CC, and still escape danger makes her really hard to catch and kill. And lastly, guys, we take a look at emblem sets. The only one I ever use on her is the Magic Emblem set. Alright guys, now we got that stuff out of the way, let's get started and show you what she's like in a game. Alright guys, let's get into this game, our Kagura gameplay video. I'm excited. I love the new Christmas theme. It's pretty dope. Alright. <clears throat> Alright, we got the old wife playing Raffaella. is going to go with us. We got... Oh, I like this team comp. We got Maya. We got 
Minotaur. And we got somebody trying to decide who they're going to play. All right, I'm going interference. Magic ammo set. Any equipment scheme we just talked about. Don't have the skin yet. I actually, I don't actually like the skin that much. I don't think it's that. Pretty much the same thing. All right. <clears throat> oh, Gord, huh? Two mages. Okay. This is not a bad team. Kind of don't have any assassins, but figure it out. Figure it out. Fanny, two assassins, two fighters, and an ADC on the other team. We got a healer and a tank. I feel pretty good about that. Hopefully that uh that plays out good for us. Either way, Raphael and Kagura are going to dominate their lane. I'm excited. I've been playing a ton of Kagura. Um, I've got 50 games on her now. And I'm really excited to show you guys what she's capable of putting up. She is a monster. And I average about 35 to 40%. About 30 to 30 to 40% damage done for my team every game she her damage output is insane she may not get the most amount of kills i mean i've i've gotten 15 plus a bunch of times but some games i don't get a lot of kills i get a ton of assists but the damage i do and the disruption i cause is well worth it every single time and i do a lots of pl plenty of early poke <clears throat> i don't know why gord is coming here like uh staying here like oh there you go gord well you figured it out i'm proud of you I'm proud of you bud that's the problem with playing with Raphaela. Every single game, everyone wants to go to lane with her. And I'm like, bro, we're together. We're not just playing together. We be married, right? Calm down. Lots of poke action. I like to when I use my first umbrella or my first move, which is to shoot the umbrella out. I like to I like to move it while it's out a lot. It's a lot better to do, in my opinion, than to just fresh move it. <clears throat> I feel like it, it's a little bit faster. It's harder to dodge. All that good jazz. There we go. Look at that damage. Oh, man. I love the her early game poke is pretty disgusting. Just sit here and pokes. They're totally, like, afraid. Like, they're not even getting any farm right now because they can't come close enough to farm, which is what it's all about. <clears throat> She's really good at zoning them out early game and, uh, Look at this miserable. If I were him, I'd be so pissed right now. He probably is probably where they're like throwing his phone up against walls and stuff. It's pretty awesome. Whenever you're making somebody throw their phone against a wall, it's a good day. Not that I've ever done that myself. That'd be ridiculous. Good job. Good job. Man. <clears throat> I'll tell you what makes life a little easier is a pretty decent Raffaello. A lot of fun to play with. really want to get first blood here oh man I have interference and I'm really tempted to jump in there really tempted to jump in there Yenja was so close to dead he's not even backing too he's like I'm looking to die <clears throat> maybe we can trick him by thinking that I'm not that close and I'm gonna go up in this bush here or maybe he's just going back I have this until now level four we got our ult these guys are so far behind I love it while the minions are down, is actually a good time for me to tower. Oh no! Oh crap, I meant to dive to my uh. I had to reset last second time. <clears throat> good, good job, Raphael. Good job getting out of danger there. Man, these guys are being zoned out so hard. They are so scared of coming out of their tower. <laughs> Love it. Oh, Fanny. Watch out for Fanny. Get out, get out. I'll help you out there, baby. Ain't nothing to worry about. Kagura got you covered. I used a couple of my moves there, but I still have my Umbrella Out ult, so I call it. I don't even know these. I mean, look at these names, guys. Yin Yang Overturn. I guess that's not that hard. Lu Shang Umbrella Flea. King Ming Umbrella Open. I mean, come on, bro. What the heck? Alright. Oh man, I really want to get a kill. I really want to get a kill. I'm not going to force it though. I don't want to die for it. But I will kill him. Get out of there, baby. Mm. 
Mm -mm. That poke is so good. That poke is so good. Man, they don't know I'm here too. So I'm sneaking in this one. There we go. There we go. There we go. That's how a big boy does it. Got him. Uh, I didn't even use interference, guys. I just jumped in and out and went crazy. I got my regen still. I don't even know. Oh, Maya got killed too. Did you get Maya? Oh, man. Rafaela doing some dope damage, knocking Maya down to the ground. Let's get this tower down so we can roam. The Kagura Rafaela uh, team here is really, actually, really fun to roam with. Come out of shadows with a stun and some faction. Pretty awesome. Oh. Look, she's like, I'm a healer. I'll just take the damage and heals up. No big deal. Oh, Yunzao wants another death. I thought that hard death would have been enough for a little while. Oh, he's like, I'll take the umbrella to the face. Oh, she, she, Maya likes it. They don't like it. They don't like taking umbrellas to the face. Oh my god, I couldn't even capitalize on that. Now I can. Oh god. I'm not gonna lie to you guys. I screwed that up four ways. I really, that was not what that was supposed to look like. Oh, we got a bunch of them on us. Get out of here. Get out, get out. Get out. There you go. <clears throat> there you go. Too bad they're not staying in. I would totally jump in again. Oh, look, they all. Oh, don't let them trick you. My money's that they're in this river bush here. Oh, maybe not. Good way to check, though. Use that umbrella for what it's meant to be used for. Maya really wants to die. She just told me. Umbrella is awesome for clearing minion waves. That we are killing the money train right now. I know we are. Knock this down. Maya's ready to die. Boom. Shoot her back. Oh, come on, Maya. Don't be like that. I was going to use my ult, but no, nah, it's not a good position to kill anymore. <clears throat> but we're going to push this up a little bit more, and then we're going to go ahead and back. Oh, I'm going to back anyways. I need mana. Alright, I'm going to back. You should probably back too. It's not safe for you alone here. Look at me back in, not even in a bush like a boss. <clears throat> Man, I hope Rafaela don't die. Let's be honest about it. She's not backing. Playing it dangerous. Where's my? There she goes. Good job. All right, I'm gonna see if I can't come out of a bush here and continue to be Young Jaw's worst nightmare. I know I'm already hit that level, so I just want to hit it even further. Oh wait, wait, Fanny's coming in. She's in that bush right there. She's in this bush right here. There she is. Get out! Get out! That's not you. you have slain an enemy. Oh man. This is like... I mean, this is not my greatest hits, that's for sure. But, we're 2-0 -oh and 2, 7 minutes in. Not the worst thing that's ever happened to me. I've got my first item. I'm getting close to getting my second item. My first two items, guys, are CDR. The, I mean, the poke ability of the umbrella, being able to move it around. Her, she's 100% ability based, so CDR is super, super key on her. Going anything but CDR is just not not a good idea in my opinion. AP CDR, call it a game. Man, I have got Yun Zhao pegged down so hard. I really want to get in there and freaking finish him off. He's almost dead. He if he gets a little close, he's gonna die. I have interference. I can still dive. And I can finish that dude off quick. There he is. There he is. I didn't even need to do that, but I did. Oh, Fanny. Fanny's trying to come in on us. Watch out for Fanny. All right. 302. Eight minutes in the game. Like I said, not the greatest start in the entire world, but <clears throat> I know I'm doing a lot of damage. I know I'm causing lots of disruption. I'm really, I'm really effing things up for their team. Oh. Also, I haven't mentioned it yet, but her escape ability is off the charts. She can get out of crazy, crazy stuff. She has two essential ways of doing that. With her go to the umbrella move and her dash, her she got a really awesome dash. No, Fanny. Man. She comes, there she comes. There's a the big girl. Natalia has been trying to kill me like so much and she's not been doing anything. 
Come on, Natalia. Come on, Natalia. There you are. Oh, man. Took that right through her. Just waiting for it. I play way too much Natalia to not know exactly what she's thinking about doing. Sorry, bro. Oh, look at that escape ability. That's what I was talking about, guys. That escape ability is off the charts. What? We're losing turrets? Oh god, bot lane. How what an embarrassment. We I mean, the amount of disruption that we're causing, the amount of uh, trouble we're causing them, we should be freaking pushing these towers better. We're not doing a very good job of we're gonna knock down mid here. We got you bot top down. Okay, we're doing we're doing that. Oh oh Natalia's bot. She wants to die, she's in our bushes, let's get her. She oh she's gonna go in oh there she is, okay. Come on, come on, come on. She needs to get in the bush to get out, and she's in this one. Come on, where'd she go? Oh, man. Fooled us all. Or at least me. All right, I'm going to go clear this bot wave. Let's kill Turtle after this, get some money and XP. There we go. Now we got some more CDR. Love it. Move out that bad boy. Get this turtle action going. Oh man, it's gonna take a while with us. I'm not gonna take a lot of damage because I keep getting this shield refilled, but it's gonna take a little. See, when you, I can keep moving my umbrella in. It's not that bad actually. I just keep shooting my umbrella. I keep getting the shield. I keep stunning him. Um, now I'm taking a little damage. I'm gonna back anyways. I'm gonna mana, so it's no big deal. But this little bonus we get from turtle is well worth it. All right, three zero and four. Ten minutes in the game, about eleven minutes in the game. I'm gonna back. I'm out of mana, but the damage starts getting real right about now, guys. I got two, three items, including boots. I'm working on my third, which is a huge power boost. Top lane is getting murdered. We need to go help out top lane. Come on, Raphael, let's go help out top lanes. Oh man. Let's see, are they even hurting? Um, a couple of them are hurting. Oh man. Uh, oh, they see me. Good stun, good stun, that's good. We're not, we're not looking to get kills at this point, we're just looking to keep this tower up and survive, so I'll take it. And this, I would love to kill this bomb though, I'll tell you that much. Oh no, get him. Finish him off, oh I got him. Oh no I don't, oh no I don't, oh my gosh. Oh no, oh no. Help me, help me. Got him. Watch this, guys. Watch this. Bam. See you later. That's the escape of Billy I'm talking about. He's like, what happened? Oh, my God. I'm just, I don't even know. What is what is happening in this world? You're dying, bro. You're getting murdered. 5014. Oh, God. He was, like, just running around. And then, bam, I was gone. He was like, uh, I'm confused. He was so lost. It was awesome. Making people look like fools is one of the greatest things this game has to offer. There we go. I saw that the turret was uh, interfered by somebody, so I just went ahead and jumped in, did some extra poke. This game's going down in flames for them. I'm pretty jazzed about that because that's what this game's about. Embarrassing your team. I guess winning is involved too. I'm just gonna go ahead and I'm gonna go ahead and toss out there and pop my ult. Oh, my ult's in cooldown. Dang. Thought it had been a little while, okay. Uh, they're running, they're running scared. Boom. Kick him out, and finish him off. Bam. I didn't have my other ult, but it didn't matter. It didn't make a difference. When you got those kinds of moves, it simply does not matter. Oh, look at that. The dive throw like a boss. Boom. Godlike. Look at this guy. He's like, I got it. I'm going to save the day. No, you're not. You're probably going to die in a second, let's be honest. Um, dude, I'm not close enough. No. All I want to do is kill all of you. Interference. Uh, I got it. Ah, Darn you, cooldowns. Darn you. The cooldowns are the bane of her existence, so cooldown reduction items are simply the best. Oh, nice stun. That was sexy. Watch this, watch this. Bam! Oh, legendary. That's me again. Boom. Bam. Oh, I didn't get it, but I really made that bad boy happen, didn't I? Man. 
Eight oh and five. Pretty legit start. Oh my man, I was just coming back too. Um, have I got? Oh man, I've got that too. I'm working on magic pen, which is going to be another big time damage boost. Every time you get a new item, it's just like you go to another level with her. It's awesome. Our team's winning 17 to 10. I mean, honestly, besides me and Raphael, our team is not doing great. We're we're carrying this game hardcore. Another one. So what you got to do, guys, with that is you throw the umbrella out. You step in behind them. You're using your blue ult to knock them forward, and then you're either throwing them in, throwing another umbrella at them, or you're gonna dash through them and then use your purple ult, which is gonna finish them off. And it all depends on how much health they have. If they, ha if you can finish them off with another umbrella, do that. I'm getting really greedy right now, guys. I'm not even gonna lie to you. I'm getting real greedy right now. I want all the kills in the whole world. Oh, did they surrender? Ah, oh, I was gonna get more kills. Wait, I'm sitting in the middle of two people just murdering them both. They have no idea what to do. Got myself a legendary. I'm gonna go ahead and take a wild guess I got MVP. Hell yeah, I did. 9-0-5. Killed the gold game by a large margin. Rafaela murdered that game with 2-0-8. The rest of our team was okay. I mean, we had... Minotaur, 4-3-3 three, and three is a good game, um, but not great. He's only evolved in 7 out of 18 kills for a support. That's not that great. He should be evolved in at least 50% of the kills. Mayav's 2-4-7. and seven. I mean, she's damage deal. Now look at this. Damage. 44% of the team's damage was your girl, Kagura. That's what she's capable of. That's what she's just carrying the game, wrecking havoc, unkillable. I mean, absolute straight murder. Uh, guys, thanks for watching this game. It was a lot of fun to play <laughs> a lot of fun to uh, record for you guys um, If you guys liked the video, please give us a thumbs up subscribe to the channel and leave some comments for us uh, below We appreciate it um, You know check out our other videos. We have we're gonna have to be doing gameplay videos spotlight videos We're gonna do highlight videos reveal videos on all the champions that we can we're making our way down the list guys We're gonna be doing some stuff on show next. We appreciate you guys watching until next time Bye.